Here's three ways to use FabFilter Pro Q3 on vocals. Number one is to use a low cut filter to take out any rumble or noise that's in the low end that you won't need and isn't part of the vocal register. I tend to bring it up to about a 100 and that usually works well. Last night I was out with the boys till two. Next, I'll use dynamic EQs to take out any of the mud in the vocal, usually around 200 to 500. Last night I was out with the boys till two. It's gonna take a whole month to make it up to you. Lastly, add a high shelf around 10K for some brightness and another dynamic EQ around the same spot to get rid of any sort of sibilance. Last night I was out with the boys till two. It's gonna take a whole month to make it up to you. 